Hey guys, thanks for joining me on Flea's Bourbon Journey. Got a little surprise for you. Walking into a place I had never been before, but it comes highly recommended. We're gonna see what we think. Library Pub, Friday night. Go and see what they got for me. Hey guys, so we're sitting at the bar at Library Pub. Suffice it to say they have a really, really large selection. I stumbled upon a couple that I'm going to try tonight along with my buddy Trung here. Say hi, Trung. <laughs> we're not out here to get a buzz on. We're just out here to enjoy a little company with each other, get us a taste of something we wouldn't own, including these. Here we have Elijah Craig Barrel Proof A119 and Elijah Craig Barrel Proof A117. I'm going to be getting an ounce of each. Let's see what I think. All right, guys. So what I got here is Elijah Craig Barrel Proof A119, okay? This came out before I was in my bourbon journey, okay? And I've never tried it, never nosed it, never tasted it. Let's see what we think. Oh, the nose is so soft on this one, you guys. The oak just disappears behind the dark fruit on this one. I'm getting fig, maybe a cranberry. And a and almost like a burnt caramel on the nose. Let's see what the palate thinks. Guys, this does not drink like it's 135.2 proof. And the mouthfeel is incredible. Rich, oily, it got my salivaries going right off the bat. Excellent pour. I might have to see if somebody's got some bunkered somewhere that I could give a try to maybe coax it out of them. Everybody talked about the A119. I understand why. 67.6% .6 alcohol by volume, 135.2 proof. And it drinks like it's 95 proof, you guys. It's incredible. Mm. Let's ask uh, Trung. Trung, what do you got in your glass over here? You got Weller Special Reserve. 45% alcohol by volume, 90 proof. Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey, Buffalo Trace product. What do you think? Pretty good, actually. Well, I'll mix it with some ice, so... You know what? No rules, just whiskey. Yeah, there you go. All well, right. this, this one right here I have plain, so... Have you tried it straight yet? Take a little set and see what you think. Pretty smooth. Smooth, eh? Yeah. Well, let's toast our smooths, man. Hi, right, brother. It's a brotherhood. It's a brotherhood. Okay. Oh yeah. Nice? Yeah, pretty good. Alright guys. Hit me in the comments down below. Tell me what you think about me suggesting that to Trump. He's kind of new to some of the mid-shelf stuff. So we're trying to start off easy. I didn't want to burn his throat with the 135 proof right off the bat. But what I have next for you is the Elijah Craig Barrel Proof A117. This comes in at 127 proof, okay? 63.52 ABV. I'm gonna cleanse the palate first. Let's see what the nose knows. Oh, the oak forward on this one. That oak is right up front, you guys. But it's good. It's a sweet oak. Almost like a brown sugar. It's got a good nose. And some caramel. Oh, guys, this one's going to be good, too. A117. Let's see what the palate thinks.
All right, that's a heavy hitter. That one comes on strong at the beginning. You definitely got the heat on that one. It does not drink at 127 proof. It drinks like 110. It's it's up there, but it dissipates. And what we got on flavors, the oak is kind of the forward flavor. And there's a good vanilla in the middle. And at the end, it's like a vanilla cream caramel. Really, really good. So you guys, for two of these that I'll never be able to own, most likely, I'm definitely gonna try to chase that A119 down. Keep your fingers crossed for me. But for two bottles that I never get to own, getting an ounce pour down here at the library pub, North 90th Street in Omaha. I'm telling you guys, their selection can't be beat. And I'm gonna show you. Guys, they've got stuff all along the wall in front of the bar. Okay? And I don't want to show off any customers that don't want to be on camera. But off the trunks right hand side, you got even more stuff on tap. Even more bottles. And the even more of the selection at Library Club. You ain't gonna find it anywhere else. This is the place, you guys. Guys, I'm telling you, the people that have told me Library Pub has one of the biggest selections in Omaha, all of the walls, all the way around, scotches, Irish, international, whiskey, bourbon, anything you want, it's here. And it's reasonable. And the folks behind the bar, they're knowledgeable. Worth it? Worth the difference, I, and not worth it in your I, opinion? I don't think it's worth the difference. Like how how, how hype this one is with uh -huh. the small batch is so good. Small yeah. small batch is really good. This is not enough better to be worth it. Exactly. Yeah. I got you. They, uh, they even have their barrel store pick still has some left in the bottle. There aren't any left to buy, but if you get down here in time, you can get a core or two of their store pick of the barrel bourbon. Guys, thanks for joining me tonight on Flea's Bourbon Journey. I hope you enjoy your bourbon journey. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Because you never know what I'm going to do next. And stay safe.